Yo, 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 it's Jimmy G23 here, and welcome to my last um, OP cheap meta center mid midfielder cards, players, whatever um, for you guys. Um, this one's going to be going over 77 rated through 75 rated. Um, if you guys watch any of the videos, I'm not including any of the players you guys should essentially already know. Um, these are a little bit of the cheaper kind. Um, try to find ways to fit these players in your squad. Um, this video is going to be relatively short because there's not as many meta players. I have five players on here for you guys. The um, reason why I'm doing this is because I have these midfielders. Um, I believe in midfielders and center backs are your core of your team. Um, they essentially make a square, um, really, or you could have a rear triangle. Um, but I really truly believe in that and so i um, trying to give you the most balanced and OP players to look at um, Here's the cheaper squads or the cheaper players obviously and so let's go ahead and uh, dive into this right meal um, Very first one I think is great. I think he's a solid player a solid card just looking at it He has three star skills four star weak foot what I like about him is one He looks like a really true center defensive mid he's 6'3 um, medium attacking work rate, high defensive work rate. Um, pace is not bad, you know. If you're if you're on a budget, uh, if you if you get this card, I wouldn't sell him. I think he's a, he's going to be a great card. He has pretty good long shots here. Shot power is 79, long shots is 75. Curve is a 72 as well. Short passing, long passing is okay. Vision's all right. Um, really, what I like about him is that his even though his jumping is not the best, he has 78. Um, uh, heading accuracy so he's able to he's he'll probably be good for headers his defense overall is not bad he has 87 stamina 83 strength and 81 aggression as well and uh, you guys probably guessed it if you guys seen any of my previous videos previous videos is you got to apply that powerhouse on him and he goes from a 77 rated center defensive mid all the way up to an 83 so um, it really boosts his passing and his defense. He's, he, this is a card that you really need to have a true center defensive or true have it be a true center defensive card. You could obviously apply an engine on there to boost his um, pace or whatever, but to get the most out of this card would be at a center defensive mid. Um, he is in also um, the Spanish League, and I believe that's a Turkey flag. Um, next up, we have a German player from the Turkey League. Um, funny that um, he three star skill moves four star weak foot. He's five eleven medium medium defensive uh, uh, and offensive work rates. Not bad acceleration. He's also have has pretty good um, long long shots and well as shot power. Um, short passing is an eighty two vision eight seventy three. Um, I believe he is a center defensive mid, so that's what you want to play him as. Um, you know he barely makes a cut. This is just you know he hits the seventies all around. Um, Throw a powerhouse on him, and then he's uh, he's an 82 rated center defensive mid and a center mid as well. Um, you could also apply an artist on him if you want him to be just a true center mid, and then I believe he gets to an 83. Yeah, he gets to an 83 rating as well. So if you want him to be a true center defensive mid with pretty good passing stats, decent dribbling stats, and um, and pretty good at long shots, this would be a card to use for, as a German player if you're doing a German nation starter squad. Um, even though he's from the Turkey League, like I said, German nation, um, he'd be great to use. Um, next up, we have this German, or I'm not this German, this Brazilian player uh, from, I believe, the Greek League. Um, so a lot of these are going to be one-offs, um, but, you know, these are really great players for um, national starter squads. Um, Three-star skill moves, four-star weak foot. He's 5'11", not too bad. High attacking work rate, medium defensive work rate. Long shots, shot power is not bad, acceleration is pretty good, short passing 80, vision 75, um, he has 83 jumping, um, heading accuracy is kind of iffy, um, it's, it's, it's all good though, but if you want him to be a true center uh, center mid, um, like like you guys have seen before, just play, apply an artist on him, and he's going to be an 83 rated center mid, and he actually goes up seven, 7 ratings, which is insane, so apply this on him, and it's going to be great. Uh... Yeah, overall phenomenal. I don't think I have anything else on him for, for you guys. Um, Reaction 71. Yeah, you know, not a bad card. He's Brazilian, so I think he's a pretty good matchup as well. Um, next card for you guys is have I have Ndai um, from Senegal. What I like about this card, even though he's also in Turkey League again, 
uh, aside from being a three-star weak foot, three-star skill move, 5'11", high and defensive work rates, he's pacey. 85 pace, 80, um, 85 acceleration, 85 sprint speed, long shots, shot power is not bad. He is positioning is okay. Short passing, 75, 73. His dribbling is actually pretty good. 82 agility. Um, his stand tackle and his marking is not bad as well. And then he's, his physicality is actually pretty good as well. So if you want him as a center defensive mid, you know it. You guessed it. Throw that powerhouse on him. And that goes from a 74 center defensive mid all the way up to an 81 rated. So that's seven rating increase right there for you guys. Um, I think that's phenomenal. If you want to play him maybe even as a center attacking mid, uh, throw that artist on, on there. Um, he goes from an 81 to an 82 center attacking mid. Um, just to see, I forget, what does a dead eye do? Uh, 80, 82 center forward for a dead eye. Um, so I think this is a great card for a center goal. Maybe, um, I don't know about coming off the bench. He's, if you're doing a turkey league, here you go. Um, if you're doing a Senegal um, nation starter squad, here you go. Uh, but yeah, that's it. That's what I have for you guys. Oh, I have one more player. Oh, lastly, the Russian. Um, what I liked about this card is his um, shot power, long shots. Um, you notice that theme with a lot of these lower, they have pretty good long shots and uh, shot power. Physicality is fine. Uh, defense is okay. Just an overall solid, solid center mid if you're doing, I saw a couple Russian league starter squads. This is definitely one of the players you would want. 78 short passing. Pace is a little iffy, but that's fine with um, if you're doing a little bit more possession base. And then lastly, if you want to use him as a center defensive mid, um, of course, apply that powerhouse, and he goes from a 75 up to an 82, um, which is great. Uh, but that's it for you guys. That's what I have. This video is a little bit relatively shorter. Um, next video I have coming out for you guys are center backs. I'm going through the center backs, a little bit the same idea. Um, OP, very well balanced. Uh, not very well balanced, just you know, pace, defense, and physicality. I want to have include height in there, work rates, things like that, um, for the center backs as well. Um, same same concept. Uh, let me know what you guys think of these videos. Um, that center back video is gonna be will be released 12 hours after this video. Um, so keep a lookout on that. Um, go ahead, hit a like. Um, and if you're feeling feeling you know generous enough, uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because uh, I got plenty and plenty and plenty more uh, uh, content coming to you guys. And so social media links down below. Uh, feel free to give me likes on or follow me on Twitch, Instagram, or Twitter. But that's it, y'all. Jimmy G23 is out. Peace.